Hey y'all, welcome back to A Dash of Gratitude. My name is Beth. Today's video, I'm gonna show you a little bit of a shopping haul and a try on. I went thrifting and I went to Target to look for some holiday decor. And I'm so excited to share with you the things that I found. Let's get to it. <laughs> you wanna say hi? Hey. Hi, YouTube. This is Robbie, if you haven't met him. Ah. He is six years old and he loves to pop in and say hello every now and then on the channel. Pop. Pop. <laughs> All right, let me start with what I picked up from Target first. These two came from the Hearth and Hand line. They were $14.99 each and it just says stem, but I thought that they looked really realistic. Um, evergreen boughs. I just thought they were really pretty. So I got two of those. Now this, this is a metal candle holder set. It was $20 from the Wonder Shop. As I was shopping through Target, I decided that this year I want to incorporate more gold into our decor. So I thought these were really pretty, kind of a brassy gold. This bottle brush tree set was $10. They also are gonna go really nicely with the gold, I think. Kind of warm, goldy colors. This set of three bells is from the Wonder Shop and it was $3. It's actually an ornament, but I might use it in a different way, so I'm not quite sure about that. I just thought it was so pretty and it, sound, it sounds nice too. Sweet little bell. These sweet little deer ornaments, they were $3 each. They're also from the Wonder Shop and I got, they have gold detail on them as well, and they're a nice little cream color. I got three of the female deer and two of the male deer, kind of to represent our family. So um, one for Brandon and Robbie, and then one for myself, Olivia, and Serena. Each of our kids have their own set of ornaments that we've collected throughout the years, and so it'll be nice that they can each have one of these from this year. These also are from the Wonder Shop. They are little snack bowls, and I don't remember how much they were. They were not very expensive, but they're not marked on here. Anyway, I thought these would be really cute to use on a charcuterie board to fill with, you know, whatever, like little marshmallows, maybe for a hot cocoa board or little candies or little bitty crackers or something like that. So I just thought these would be a really sweet for holiday charcuterie boards. Also from the Wonder Shop, I picked up these cookie cutters. We do have some cookie cutters, but I don't have any little ones. And again, my thought was for these to use them on a charcuterie board as well. Well, not on a charcuterie board, but maybe to cut little slices of cheese or little meats or things like that, just to add some decorative elements to the charcuterie board. So sticking with the gold theme, I found these deer. They're, they're both, um, these are from the Wonder Shop and they're $5 each. I got two. My thought for them is to use them on perhaps the dining room table. When I saw these, I immediately thought about incorporating them onto a tablescape, but I don't know, maybe on the mantle they would be really pretty, or I just picked up a new piece of furniture for our dining room. It's like a, like a sideboard, a buffet, or a server. They're, it's called many different things, but it's so pretty and this would be these would be really pretty on there as well So again, not sure how I'm gonna use them, but I just love them. I love them so much and they're not like They're not like the most high-end quality. They're plastic. I think they're just right for seasonal decoration. I Just love them. <laughs> oh dear while I was in there, I was looking for a table runner and I wanted something that had gold, obviously to help tie in the gold that, I've, that I'm going with this year. This is from the Threshold line. It's a beautiful deep green color with gold stitching in the details. I thought this was really pretty. In my head, I really wanted like a cream colored with gold. They didn't have that, but when I saw this, I, I thought this very well might work. So I'm excited to put all these things together. The whole reason I went into Target was to look for Bell Garland. $10 and I got two of them. And it's just, it's from the Wonder Shop. It's a Bell Garland, very simple, but it's exactly what I was looking for. So I got two of those. And I also got a small little lamp. It's also from the Threshold line. And I was looking for a lamp that would go on our kitchen counter. 
So I'm hoping this one will fit well and it will be what I'm looking for because um, I just love a little lamp on a kitchen counter. Well, that's all I found at Target. I actually picked up a few items from Hobby Lobby as well. So I'm gonna show you what I got. Um, Robbie and Serena were with me and they both said they needed a new Santa hat this year. We have a few, but um, they're really old. They, they're worn. These were $5.99 each and they're both the adult size. So they each got one of those. And then to go along with our hot cocoa bar that we're gonna put together this year, I got these marshmallow toppers. These were $4.99. I thought they were really cute, the little snowflake. And then I picked up this little sign, I think maybe for a tear tray, believe in the magic of Christmas. It's got Santa and his sleigh. And then one more, I just thought this was so cute. Very simple, kind of rustic. Um, another little sign with no words. It's just got the sweet little uh, Christmas trees. It's got green on the sides. This also will work really well on a tiered tray. All right, that's all I got at Hobby Lobby. All right, next I'm going to show you what I got thrifting. Here's what, here's what happened. All right, that's my thrifting haul. Ugh. All right, I found myself with a free day recently and I decided to go out and do a little bit of thrifting. Brandon and I have a work holiday party to go to for his work. And so I kind of went with that in mind. I kind of, I wanted to find a dress that might be fitting for the occasion. And I haven't really been out shopping for myself for clothes, like on a specific trip to go out and look specifically for clothing for myself in quite a while. I do tend to go through the clothing section at Sam's Club and Costco. Look, I'm a mom, I'm busy, I rarely have time to myself, we homeschool, the kids are always with me. And so it's just easier for me to do that type of clothing shopping. It might not be exactly what I'm looking for all the time, but it works. And, um, but it also makes specific special shopping trips out for myself a little bit, I don't want to say like a luxury because that sounds very dramatic, but it just, it's just nice to be able to go out with a purpose with your own self <laughs> to any store. And, you know, we try to be budget minded and, uh, you know, I love a good consignment store or a good thrift store. So I'm going to show you what I picked up. And then I'll do a little try on haul at the end. I got this jacket. So I'm gonna tell you, I'll tell you the, the brand label on everything and then how much I paid for it. This piece is from the Wild Fable line. It's at Target. It was marked 1029, but it was on clearance and half off. But I thought it was really cute for the holiday season. It's a jacket and it's not, um, it's not for warmth. It's more just for style but add in that little pop of color like a little bit of like a like a little bit of a blazer this next dress is from mud pie and it was marked twenty dollars and 29 cents and <clears throat> it really fits nice and comfortably and i love the bell sleeves with the ruffles <laughs> so cute. So I'm thinking this one might work for the holiday party. I love a good animal print and especially if it's comfortable. So I can't wait to show you that one. Actually all of these I'm really excited about because I I really like the way all of them fit. This next one is from Chico's and it was marked $14.29 but it was 20% off because the yellow labels were 20% off. But I just thought this was so pretty and would be really nice with a pair of black slacks or maybe a skirt, but it's kind of velvety and it's shiny and it's so comfortable. It fits just right. Very nice. This next one is from Knox Rose. That's also a Target line. And it was marked $12.29. Now this dress is red, which made me think of the holiday season, but also it's just comfortable. It's just a casual, a casual comfortable dress. So cute. This sweater top is from White House Black Market. It was marked at $14.29. And it's just like a thin sweater material top. And the back has this really cute crisscross detail. Something just a little bit different, soft and cozy. And that's a pretty good brand name, so I like the quality of it as well. 
This too is from White House Black Market and it was marked $14.29. And it's a little bit more of a dressy top, fitted at the waist, but um, loose all everywhere else. And it's kind of like a silky material. Let's see. What the blend is polyester and spandex, but it's very silky. It feels really nice. It's really comfortable. And I thought this would be pretty with, you know, black slacks. You could even dress up some jeans with some heels. Anyway, we'll see. We'll see what I do with that one. This type, the type of material this dress is made out of is usually not my go-to. I usually don't like the way that it looks, but when I saw this dress and the price, it's marked at $12. It doesn't have a label even, but what I like, what I do like about this type of material is that it is a pretty much wrinkle-free. You can throw this in a bag if you're traveling and it's gonna come out looking great. But my idea for this dress, I'm telling you, even on, even on the camera, I'm like, ooh, this is not it. But um, my thought was, I love rusty red. That's, probably, that's my favorite color is rusty red. And I have a pair of gray boots that I think will be so cute with this. I also like the bell sleeve for going out. I don't like to wear those around the house or anything, but, um, but I thought this would be a really cute going out dress, maybe with, you know, girls night out or date night out or whatever. I've got two more pieces to show you and they are both from Old Navy. This one is definitely like a, it's a thin material, like very, it's cotton, $12, but, um, I got it specifically because of, well, it fits really well, but also the green made me think of the holiday season. And, you know, we live in South Carolina. It rarely gets really cold here. So I think I'm going to wear this today. Actually, I've got a birthday party to go to for one of my nieces and it's just really pretty. I love the green with the white. It fits really well. It's, it's kind of a shorter, it's a short dress, not too short, just right. So I'm really excited about that. And then this last one, I won't be able to show it to you in full here from this angle, but it's also from Old Navy. It is a long, long sleeve, longer dress. It's not floor length, but um, it's so soft. It's like in brand new mint condition. This one was marked, again, $12, $12 for this dress. I love the scoop neck on it. It's really nice. I'll show you in just a minute, you know, for real, but um, it's a long sleeve. If I can stretch. So it's not floor length, but it's a good length. And I think this would be really cute with boots or flats. And I'm looking forward to wearing this, this holiday season too. I like, again, it has like that rusty, rusty orange kind of color, but it also has red and I love a floral and I love black, so it's just right. And like I said, it's, it has no wear on it. It's like, it's like in mint, it's in mint condition, $12. Okay, so all in all, I had, I bought nine pieces for just over $100. And you just can't get that kind of a deal anymore, anywhere out in the store. For me, thrifting is where it's at these days. Let me give you a little fashion I show. bet you didn't wake up this morning thinking you were gonna get to see a modeling runway fashion show, but here we are. Here's the velvety top from Chico's. I love that it is comfortable, kind of casual, but also nice. You can dress it up, dress it down. I like this one a lot. Up next is this thin sweater top. I love, love, love the way this fits. It feels so comfortable on, it fits just right. And I really like that back detail with the crisscross. Now, every time I try on a long sleeve shirt, I always pull up the sleeves a little bit, just like this, to see how it's going to fit because, you know, I am a hardworking mama. I'm always pulling up my sleeves to get to work. You know what I mean? Now, this blouse is so nice. It's feminine. I love that it's comfortable, a little bit loose fitting in all the right places, but I do think it's really flattering and it wears really nicely. So I'm excited to wear this top out. This dress, y'all, is everything. I know it's nothing super special or fancy, but it's so comfortable. And I wore it today to my niece's birthday party, and it's awesome. You can wear it buttoned in the front or unbuttoned. Either way is fine. It's a great length. It is so comfortable. I love it. I wish I had more dresses in this cut and style. 
Speaking of casual dresses, this red one is great. I'm really looking forward to wearing this one as well. I feel like, you know, you could just wear this any day of the week. It does not have to be a special occasion. Just an everyday knock around dress. And here is the one that I was iffy about in the store, but when I tried it on, I loved it. You know what else? Besides it being my favorite color, that rusty red, it's also that kind of gray, black, and creamy kind of detail colored in there. It matches my hair. It looks really good. I love that dress. Okay, here's the mud pie dress that I'm thinking about for the holiday party. I think it's so fun. These sleeves are great. I love that it's not form-fitting. I can dance. I can move. Going to the party, it's going to be perfect for the occasion. And this dress here, it's fitted on the top and the sleeves. The skirt is loose, loosey-goosey. This material is so soft. This dress is so comfortable. I know I've said that about everything, but it's really, really true. All these clothing pieces are so lovely. I love the way the sleeves fit, pulled up. Great, super fun dress. All right, obviously I wouldn't wear these together. I don't have anything else to wear to like try this on with. But so here's the jacket. Also the tag, I also wanted to say the tag is still on here from the original like in the store tag. This was marked $30, I paid five. So if you're on a budget, don't sleep on those consignment shops. I had a really good time thrifting and I love all the items that I found. And uh, it just feels good to like pick up a few new pieces, you know, every now and then. So I hope you enjoyed this haul and try on video. If you did, please make sure to give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already. Thank you for adding a dash of gratitude to your day and I'll see you on the next video.